No, nah, it wasn't. It wasn't any message. Um, coach knew that you know against Florida, our last game of the season would be a game that we really needed, and uh, he wasn't sure that you know if I would be able to get in the game anytime. So he just wanted to see if I wanted to go in against Mississippi State and try to step on the court for one last time because he just wasn't sure if against Florida I would be able to do that. So I agreed, and, and that's what happened. It's just a coincidence that it came against your old school. Yeah, it wasn't anything anything towards Mississippi State or anything like, anything like that. It was just our last home game before Florida, and he just wasn't sure if you know the Florida game it'd be motions, you know. And I don't want anybody, I don't want the team to be you know focusing on me and getting me in the game at all. I just need them to focus and going down and getting the win. So. Guys always talk about Calipari being a player. What, is, what did that mean to you that he wanted to make sure you got to step on the court at Rupp Arena one more time and, and, and kind of stand there and look around and have the crowd cheer for you? Yeah, it meant a lot. You know, I've always admired Coach and the way he coaches and how he is towards us, and he cares a lot about us. And uh, when he came to me at, and during the game at the end of the bench, you know, I was all smiles. I didn't think I was going to be able to go in the game or step on. The, I didn't really know if I ever step on the court again, especially with my injury. And then when he said that, I just got the almost respect for him. What did it mean to you, Lonnie, to to do it against Mississippi State? <laughs> I mean, I know. I mean, you know. Yeah, I mean, it didn't mean anything. Um, you know, because before the game and after the game, you know, a bunch of those guys are still my friends and some of the coaches, they're still there. And so it didn't mean anything. He just, coaches decided to do it. And, and unluckily, it was against Mississippi State, but it didn't mean anything. So what do you think your future is, Bonnie? Where do you go from here? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Um, you know, I just want to, right now, I'm just taking my time and trying to get healthy. And um, I'm going to sit down with coach after the season and see, you know what I'm saying, if I'm healthy. What options that I'll have? If I can get back in basketball shape, then I'll try to explore some options there. Do you want basketball to be to be part of the future if you can? Yeah, I want. It, yeah, I, I want. If I can get back healthy, I want to. I want to continue to play basketball. But if it doesn't work out for me, then I wouldn't be upset at all. I've, I've had a good career and in my career at the school, I've always wanted to be at in my dream school. So I've had a pretty good career. How many fans? I'm not sure. I still got to uh, see how many tickets are going to be available because this is going to be a tough game. And uh, with a lot of family, uh, our last game of the season, a lot of family going to be in of other players. So I just got to see how many tickets I can get available. Uh, thank you.